Greetings, everybody. And welcome to the Zero One Time Show. <laughs> Up on top of an elephant. Hey, but you want to know what? There's something really big getting that ready to happen. It's about womankind worldwide. This is being held by Basel. Best of Second Life. This is a charity fund. But you want to know what? It's about the fashion. Fashion for change. It's a big deal because guess what? These people care about taking care of other women in all parts of the world. They come together and they get this done. But these are the designers and this is where it starts right here. This is how it works. I'm telling you, there's a big color of couture fashion event where they actually compete in styling. There is also another wonderful fashion runway event also. And and, and the designers, oh, it's just amazing all the designers, 43 designers from Rogue. It's just phenomenal to see these people come together and pull themselves together. And you know what I know, the second life spirit of getting together and collecting charitable thoughts and taking care of the community all about the world. It's a big deal because that's what beautiful pixels do and designers that create them. Let's head on over to the show. And hello, <laughs> down from my big old elephant. And we're here, this is where the show's going to start. This is where I'm going to be opening up tomorrow with fireworks and everything else. But that's not what it's about. This is about a womankind. It's worldwide. It is a UK-based international women's rights charity. It's working to help women transform their lives and communities in Africa, Asia, and Latin America. It is celebrating its 25th anniversary just this last 2014. It's going on 26 years. Now, this charity's motto is equal, respected, proud, and its vision of the world where being a woman does not limit changes, opportunities, or rights wherever she lives. This charity is aimed to support the local women's rights organizations and smaller local women's groups. These groups often, at great personal risk to themselves, are challenging and discrimination of human rights are challenging discrimination and human rights abuse and violations towards women within the countries and communities they are based in. Womankind delivers the essential support and funding expertise, contacts, and the publicity that these local grassroots women organizations need to amplify their voices and increase their impact and bring about a greater change in their communities. Hey, look at all the wonderful designers that are going to be part of this. Let's go take a look at it and check out this gorgeous sim that has been put together by Miss Virtual World, Best of Second Life, Alistair Brianna. And no, she didn't do it by herself. Trust me, I'll get to those people. As we make our way over to the auction area, just this gorgeous build and the beautiful water and the palm trees and the designers in the background. Just a beautiful build, well thought out and put together. Very modern and uh, just takes my breath away to look at all the hard work that's gone into this. Now this auction, it runs the whole two weeks. 
and finishes with a live auction finale by the well-known auctioneer Nick Cadaver. On the 25th of April, these are all unique one-only designs and offers by some, some very famous photographers. So, hey, check it out. Gorgeous stuff. Yeah, we'll make our way over here, around the corner, and over to uh, where all of these beautiful shops are at. I mean, just gorgeous. These these designers uh, have really gone out of their way uh, stuff together. They've come in here and set up, and they're doing such a great job supporting this effort. And, you know, I just can't be more thankful for all their hard work, their beautiful pixels, and all the wonderful designs they bring to people and bring everybody together. As we walk down this long, beautiful row, you can just taking in the names of Azul and Kalini, and it just goes on and on, the huge amount of support that these people give. Womankind Worldwide is a coalition of many people brought together and these women to empower these women while not being a very large charity over 25 years of its existence it has supported directly and indirectly over 18 million women and their families 2013 for instance it worked in 15 countries directly supported 141,000 women and helped improve the rights of over 6 million women. In 2013, as an example, it worked in Afghanistan, Bolivia, Ethiopia, Ghana, Kenya, Liberia, Malawi. Womankind worldwide helped a legal aid center run by local women and organizations to provide free legal support to 175 women and psychosocial support to 70 women, girls, and basic health treatment to 46 women. Bolivia, Womankind Worldwide helped 550 indigenous peasant women leaders in five out of the country's nine regions to acquire knowledge to challenge discrimination and they are now actively participating in legal politics. The list goes on and on. It's just a huge amount of help. Nepal, women worldwide, helped dilate tribal women. Political participation and their understanding of local political processes. This is huge, almost never thought of. And for $20, that's right, 20 US, you can train a police person in Peru that in issues of sexual exploitation, violence, and women's rights to ensure that they better support trafficked women and women in prostitution. $60 of U.S. could train a community paralegal in Ghana to provide legal support to survivors of violence, helping them obtain child custody and divorce and to keep their home. 300 U.S. could train 25 Ameria women in Bolivia to educate other women in their communities and on the women's rights and violence and leadership. Looking at the figures, you can see that there's a real chance that money raised in Second Life could make the real difference. Womankind worldwide is a gathering of everybody, man and woman, designers, Second Life, everybody together to help people. We got some, there's some great entertainers for Fashion for Change Entertainment, Saturday starting 11th April. Boulevard Show, that's right, 11 a.m. Torben ASP, 12 noon. TJ Amnachi, 1 p.m. And of course me, DJ Adam, 01 time with the fireworks. Sunday, 12 April, MGB Show. Danny Palazzi at 12 noon. That's right, truly telling a cool chick that she is. She's going to come out here, and I'm telling you what, she's got some great lyrics for us. Wednesday, the 15th April, DJ Max. That's right. That's all radio. Get it on, man. 1 to 3 p.m. Saturday, 
the next weekend, the 18th Color of Couture Challenge. That's right. And guess what? The winner of that challenge last year went on to become Miss Virtual World, performer at 12 noon, Maximilian Clean, and the AVI Choice winner. The show for the MVWMA, that's right, <laughs> Miss Virtual World Modeling Association. She's, they're going to come out here and show it off, stretch all stuff. Sunday at 19th April, Mrs. Show, 10 a.m., performer, 12 noon, Kiba, Kiba Tamas, DJ at 1 p.m., TBC, Wednesday. 22nd April, DJ Mex SL Radio. Saturday, the 25th April, 11 a.m. Auction Finale, Neck Kavadar Presidency. That's right. <laughs> you want to know what? That auction is going to be a big deal. And then the final finale, that's right. The one and only Walter Balazek will be there with the fireworks. I'll be kicking them off. Fireworks and foam. Walter is one of the finest. DJs in all of the virtual worlds and even owns his own grid. Thank you, Walter, for volunteering and doing this. You've been around the world since what? They're in beta stage. Hey, DJ Adam, let's check out what's to come. And you all have a great day. <laughs> 